The girls volleyball team here at USC is attacking the end of the season and playoffs head on. We sat down with head coach Alex Lindsay, who shared with us how the team is planning to approach playoffs. Uh, it's probably the same mentality that we've had all season long. We, uh, we preach having a fast start in all of our matches and finishing strong. Um, and we're really focused on uh, taking each night for what it is. We know there won't be an easy night at all during the Whitfield playoffs. So we're excited for the opportunity and we're ready for our first opponent. Then we sat down with senior Southern Annie Caverage, who shared what she thought their team's strongest asset is. I think our team's strongest asset is our hitters. We have three six-foot hitters, um, and that comes in handy. Leah Kern, a junior hitter for the team, then talked to us about who their toughest opponent is. As of right now, I feel like Seneca Valley is our toughest competitor because so far they're the only people that we have lost to, and it was a very close game. And I think it really could have gone either way, and hopefully we'll see them again later in the season. Senior Carson Mafries talked to us about what she feels the team needs to improve on. Uh, we probably need to improve on not playing down to the teams that we're not as good at, like aren't as good. So when we get frustrated, we can't just play down to their level. Outside hitter Sammy Amos then talked to us about how the team is looking heading into playoffs. Um, we're looking really strong, definitely stronger than last year. Um, we look like we're a unit and we all fit together on the court. The team is looking forward to playoffs, and freshman hitter Alex Amos shared with us what she thought the team is most excited about. Kicking butt and winning. The girls finished 12-0 in regular play and will face Pine Richland in the first round of playoffs. This has been Maddie Groninger for the Upper St. Clair Update.